Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. Description of various forms of energy. Kinetic, potential, thermal, chemical, electrical, and nuclear. Answer. Energy is a fundamental concept in physics. It's an integral part of our daily lives and exists in various forms, such as kinetic, potential, thermal, chemical, electrical, and nuclear. Each form can be converted or transformed into the others. 1. Kinetic energy. Kinetic energy is the energy an object possesses due to its motion. The faster an object moves, or the more mass it has, the higher its kinetic energy will be. For example, when you are running or cycling fast downhill, you have a lot of kinetic energy because you're moving quickly. 2. Potential energy. Potential energy is stored energy that depends on position or state of an object. An easy to understand example would be when you stretch a rubber band. It has elastic potential energy because of its stretch state. If let go, it would snap back to its original shape due to this stored potential power. Another type is gravitational potential energy, which can be seen in objects held at height. They have the capacity to do work due to their position relative to Earth's surface. 3. Thermal energy. Thermal or heat. Energy refers to the internal kinetic energies present within particles like atoms and molecules, i.e. vibrational and translational energies that generate heat. For instance, heating water on a stove transforms electrical or gas into thermal slash heat, causing water molecules vibrate faster, increasing their thermal levels until boiling point is reached, converting liquid water into steam. 4. Chemical energy. Chemical energy is another form of potential power stored within chemical bonds between atoms and compounds like food we eat or gasoline used for cars. When these bonds break during chemical reactions like digestion or combustion respectively, this stored power gets released usually as heat, thermal, light, etc., enabling us perform tasks like walking after eating food, fueling our muscles with required glucose from digestion process. 5. Electrical energy. Electrical power involves movement of electrons around atomic nuclei, creating electric charges. When these charges move or flow, we get electric current. For example, in a battery, the stored chemical power is transformed into electrical, which can be used to power devices like mobile phones or flashlights. 6. Nuclear energy. Nuclear energy is derived from processes that make use of atomic nuclei, i.e., nuclear fusion combining light atomic nuclei to form heavier ones releasing energy, sun's heat slash light, and nuclear fission, splitting heavy atomic nuclei into lighter ones releasing power, nuclear reactors. This form of energy is very powerful, but also potentially dangerous if not controlled properly, as seen in nuclear weapon detonations and accidents.